What's up everyone? Welcome to your 30 minute absolute fire arms and abs workout. So go ahead and grab some dumbbells and let's get started. Hey everyone, welcome to your upper body and abs workout today. It is called absolute fire because we're gonna do two rounds of every exercise, hammering out the biceps and then the triceps and then the abs. So we're gonna close it out with a good burn of every single exercise. Make sure you have your water and your sweat towel. And for my weights today, I'm gonna be using weights that are heavy enough to go for an overhead tricep extension. So for myself today, knowing that we're gonna do two rounds of 45 seconds per exercise, I'm gonna use 25 pounds for that one. The lightest weight that I'm gonna be using will be for a tricep kickback. So probably 10 pounds for myself for that. So pick weights that work for you in that range. We're gonna get started with our bicep set and then our triceps and close it out with core, okay? Thumbs up if you're ready. All right, let's get started. Big backward circles, three, two, one, come on. Good work. We've got 10 minutes per muscle group today. Good, switch directions. And we'll just kind of rotate shoulders, elbows, wrists, and hips before we get started. Good job. Arms out 90 degrees, let's go up and down. Open and close. Good. And open and close here. There you go, last one, take it up. And you're gonna bend and straighten the elbows. Here we go, getting a good stretch from the tip of your elbow all the way down. Three, two, one, good. Hands on your tailbone, gentle push forward and back. Nice. For our core today, it's mainly going to be laying on the floor, rectus abdominis, so if you need a little bit of a cushion, you can grab that now. Okay, let's twist it over. Good, four, three, two, one. All right, last one, reach your fingertips back, back, back. Let's just open it up. All right, pure strength workout today. So we're gonna start with two rounds of every exercise. The first one is hammer curls. All right, so I'm gonna start with my 15. I wanna keep the same weight for both rounds and beat my rep number in round number two. Ready, two. One, let's go. Count your reps here. Good job. Fifteen seconds. Two, one, rest, good job. Same thing, round number two. All right, you got 15 seconds rest. Got a little scratchy throat today. All right, three, two, beat that number, let's go. Very glad it's a pure strength workout. <laughs> Just stay focused on good form. Five bicep exercises, this is number one. Both arms are lifting together. We'll alternate later. Come on. Whoo! Absolute fire has already started. Seven. Two, one, and rest. Now, I'm gonna drop down one weight and we go supinated curls. Palms are open towards me. Both arms together, count your reps right here. Four, let's go, two, one, and go.
four, good job. Two, one, rest, awesome. All right, one more round, same thing. Keep the same weight, beat that number. And if you don't wanna count reps, just think of upping your tempo a little bit. So resting less at the bottom. Three, two, let's go, come on. Good, it's okay to look over at your arm too. Make sure you feel that connection. Good, 10 seconds, let's go. Four, two, one, and rest. Now we go alternating hammer. Okay, so you're here, down, here. So one, two, three, count your reps, okay? I'm gonna go back up to 15 and we start in four, two, one, come on. Feel free to step if you want, just to add a little bit of spice. Good form over everything, so don't give me speed with sloppy reps. And rest, perfect. All right, one more round, beat that number. And then we go alternating supinated curls. Three. And let's go. Come on, come on, 15. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Hopefully you beat your reps, right? Okay, grab those lighter weights again. Alternating, supinated. Should feel absolute fire right now, okay? Here we go, four, three, Two, count your reps, let's go. Good job, come on. Eight. Two, one, rest, good. One more round, beat those reps, and then we're moving on to triceps, okay? Here we go, seven. Four, three, two, come on, beat those reps. You versus you. So you're only beating last round version of yourself. Come 
on, go, go, go. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, tricep overhead extensions. All right, we go in seven. We're right here. Good form here, over everything. Don't speed through this. Two, one, let's go. Four, two, one, good, rest. All right, one more round, beat those reps. I'm just basically saying the same thing the whole time, I know, I just want you to stay focused here. Okay, 30 minutes, solid strength, work harder each round. Four, three, come on. Two, one, let's get it. Good job, 20 seconds. Oh, anyone else's burn like just now set in right there? Oh, come on. Five. And rest, beautiful job. Lay it down on the ground and let's keep that same dumbbell for overhead skull crushers, okay? Same movement, we're just laying down. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Ten. Two, one, rest, good job. Whew. One more round there, beat your reps there. Four, let's go. Three, two, one, come on. Come on, go harder, go harder. You got nine, eight. Two, one, good job. Come on up to standing and we're going tricep kickbacks. Light weights, okay, alternating here. One and then two. Let's go, hinge it out. Two, one, all right, come on. Keep your core tight, good job. Ten, nine.
and rest, good. All right, round two, same thing. Next round, we're gonna go straight arm pushbacks. Three, two, whoo, let's go. Feel that flex in your extension, okay? When you get to full extension, squeeze to lock your elbow out. Fifteen. Five. Good work. Push, push, push. Three, two, one. All right. Next one. If you want to go down and wait, you can. Straight arm. Okay, so you're here, here. All right, that's just keeping the tricep working to be in extension the whole time. Three, two, one. All right, let's go. Push and push. Come on, race yourself here. And I don't mean speed, I mean good reps. So race maybe is not the right word there, but <laughs> make sure you're pushing harder round two than round one. Seven. And rest, great job. All right, one more round. Beat that rep number, and then we're gonna pulse it out. With or without that sound effect, okay? Four, straight arm pushbacks. Three, two, one, get it. Fifteen. Two, one, and I'm gonna drop down actually to my five pound dumbbells. Okay, we're pulsing. I need you to count your pulses here. So one, two, three, okay? If you want, feel free to go palms up. Two, one, let's go. Push through that bird, come on. Yes, you should feel it. You should feel it really well right now. Eight. Three more. Three, two, rest, good. Woo. Okay, one more round. Maybe your goal on this one is just to not stop the whole work period. Whatever it is, let's go hard. And then we hit core, okay? Four, three, come on. Two, one, let's push. Up, 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 up. <sighs> Mentally, you're right here. Push high, push high. Fifteen. Good, let's go. Seven, six, four, three, two, 
one and have a seat. You got sit-ups, and if you can, throw a dumbbell on your chest, okay? Or two dumbbells at your shoulders. Five seconds if you need help with your setup. Use your dumbbell here, and then roll down. Let's go. If you're using your dumbbell as resistance, make sure it stays touching your chest. Breathe. One more, three, two, rest, good. All right, round number two. Let's increase that pace. Here we go. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Come on, beat your reps from last round of sit-ups. Maybe you just tap your low back and punch right back up. Fifteen. And rest. You've got sit up and twist. I want you to go to the left. So right elbow to left knee for round number one. Round number two, I want you to match that number with the other side, okay? Three, two, one, let's go. Fifteen. And rest. Good. So whatever you've got there, you're twisting the other way and matching that rep number. Okay, I've got my dumbbell on my shoulder that I'm rotating. So if you want to do that, let's go. Three. Two, one. Fifteen. Three. And rest. Woo. All right. Next one. Lean back and twist. Okay, so you're here. Tap one, tap two. Ready? Two. One, let's go. Four, 
two, one, rest. Same thing, round two, beat your reps. Okay, you're doing great, let's go. You saw me kind of switching, I'm reaching with my opposite hand across my body. Let's go. If you want to do it, feel free. Six, three, two, one, and come on down for bicycles. Body weight. Whew. If you need to modify, one heel is on the ground as you twist. Okay, if you can, legs are up. You count one, one, two, two. Ready? Let's go. Fifteen. Two, one, rest. Good job. All right, let's beat that number by at least two. Okay, crank it out here. Come on. You can do it. Woo. Four. Three, two, come on. Come on. Fifteen. Come on, go, go. Five, four, two, one, and breathe. And together, we're going to close it out with ten push ups. That's it, okay? When you're done with your 10, you're done with your workout. We start in six. Okay, finish 10 and you've made it. Good reps here, really, really good. Two, one, let's go. Your 10 best. And when you're done, you are done. Amazing job. Make your way back up to standing. When you have finished, whew, how you feeling? Good, finish your 10. If you're not there yet, get there and then come up to standing. Big open chest, whew, cross. Amazing job. Whew. Hopefully you felt a good blood flow there. Started with biceps, moved to triceps. Finish with the core, pull up and over. Let's stretch out the tricep. Good job. Quick little strength workout for your day. Make sure you don't forget the importance of good reps. As we do a you versus you week, it's very easy to jump in and say, I gotta go faster to get more reps. Okay, don't ever sacrifice the quality of your reps for quantity of reps. All right, bring it down. Pull your fingertips back. Stretch out your forearms a little bit. Okay, you versus you is always just gonna be push harder than you did in round one. Okay, but I will never tell you to push so hard that your form is failing, that you're just kind of swinging dumbbells around, that you're just kind of spinning around on your core work. 
Good reps over everything. Okay, palms face the ground. Let's tilt ear to the shoulder. Lift your chin a little bit away from your chest. And switch sides, good job. Great work. Hands on your tailbone, gentle push forward. And as you head out today, think of the quality being your most important focal point. Quality of your food. Okay, if you start somewhere, start more with how well and nutrient dense and whole you are eating instead of jumping right into calories. Okay, there's a point when you get there and you start to clean up your nutrition a little bit and then it's time to actually know how much you're eating compared to how much you're burning to get to the goals that you have. But if I can give you one piece of advice from just starting, it's clean up what you're actually doing in terms of quality. All right, sleep quality. Are you getting enough water? Making sure that your mental health is high quality. It's a high priority focus. Okay, and then making sure above all else that the food that you're eating is nutrient dense. You're getting vegetables, you're getting protein, you're getting whole grains, you're getting healthy fats, okay? Less stuff where you DoorDash or Postmates or Uber Eats, more stuff where you get just comfortable in your kitchen, okay? And you just cook and you just spend time with your food. Eventually you'll get to the point where you say, okay, this is becoming a little bit easier for me and you'll figure that out through practice and then you'll jump into maybe amounts of macros and calories but you're gonna make a huge dent if you're just starting and you focus on quality. Same thing in your workouts, quality reps, okay? This is not useful, this is, okay? So, flex it out in your nutrition, in your workouts, and make sure you are focusing on quality, and I'll see you back here for our next workout. Great job today. Before you head out, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and share this workout with all your friends. I love you, I'll see you tomorrow.